Hey, what's up you guys? Today we're gonna to be taking a look at the Thule Apex XT4 hanging style bike rack. This is a perfect bike rack for you and your family as it's really easy to use, easy to install, and very reliable when hauling your bikes to your next ride. Let's go ahead and take a closer look. So let's start by taking a look at some features for the Thule Apex XT4 bike rack. Now this is a hanging style bike rack, which means your bicycle's top tube is gonna be secured on the top of these cradles on both the arms. Now these cradles have a nice soft rubber that will prevent scratching. And this bike rack can hold up to four bikes and has a total weight capacity of 150 pounds. Although each bike can weigh up to 37 and a half pounds. Now as for security, we have this cable right here that will go over your bicycle's frames and will lock on the end of the arm, which will prevent anyone from removing your bicycle from this rack. So let's go ahead and take a look at the shank. This will fit a receiver hitch that is two inch and inch and a quarter. We have this silver adapter on here that will allow it to go into a two inch, but if you have an inch and a quarter, you can remove this using the included Allen wrench. Now to help secure it into place, we have this automatic pin that will just clip in. And once it's inside the receiver, we have this anti-wobble knob. When you tighten this up, this bar inside of the hitch receiver will expand, which will help keep it tight and secure. And we also have a key on there so that you can lock it to your vehicle. So now that we've gone over some of these features, let's go ahead and show you how easy it is to install in your vehicle. We're just gonna take our shank and we're gonna line it up with our hitch receiver. And before we place it in all the way, we're gonna take this pin and we're gonna pull it out all the way. And we're gonna make sure that our two pin holes line up on the receiver and our bike rack. Once we have it lined up, we'll push our pin in. Now, as you can see with it in place, it wobbles quite a bit. Now, that's where our anti-wobble knob comes into place. Right here, we're gonna spin this knob, and this is gonna allow it to get really tight. And once you get it right in place, you'll see that it's eliminated a lot of that sway. And now that we have this nice and tight, we're gonna go ahead and take our provided keys. We're gonna go ahead and lock it up. Now, once it's locked, you'll see that it just spins freely and it won't loosen. It won't tighten, but this way, no one can remove it from your vehicle. Now that we have our rack installed on our vehicle, you can see that it has a nice upright position, which makes it really easy to haul around town when you don't have any bikes on, especially since it doesn't stick out very far from your vehicle. Now a cool feature, we have this lever down here, and this will allow your bike rack to tilt down. Now this will give you access to your cargo area. So whether you have a tailgate, a hatchback or a trunk, you can get in and out really easy. But uh, this feature does not work if you still have bikes on, you'll have to remove those to gain access to that feature. Uh, when you're done getting access to your cargo area, you'll just pull up on that same lever and it'll click back up into that upright position. So let's go ahead and show you how easy it is to put a bike on here. Uh, to get it prepped, we have a lever up here on the top and this will allow the arms to extend so for each bike, we have two cradles that we'll be using to attach. Now, our top tube will sit on the top of these, and then we have, for the rear of the bike, our seat tube is gonna be connected by this bottom cradle. Now, we're gonna remove these straps to get it ready to put our bike on. Now that we have this prepped, let's go ahead and put a bike on. So we're gonna take our bike's top tube, and we're gonna rest it on those cradles. So with our top tube on our two cradles, the rear of the bike is gonna go on the cradle that has the two straps. This bottom strap is gonna go around the seat tube. And you'll just strap it like that. And then on the top, we're just gonna strap it down over the tube. Now it does have a nice security feature. We have this cable right here that we're gonna pull out. And towards the end of our arm, on the driver's side, we have this little notch that we're gonna push it into. And using our provided key, we're gonna lock it into place. 
and this will make it so no one can remove our bike from our bike rack. All right, guys, that wraps up our review for the Thule Apex XT4 bike rack. Now, as we could see, this was a very secure and easy to use bike rack that'll work perfect for you and your friends and family when you're going to your next bike ride. If you have any questions about this rack, or if you'd like to take a look at it, you can visit your closest U-Haul center, or you can visit us online at uhaul.com. Thank you.